What's up guys, I'm going to be showing you how to customize your LED notifications on your home button for the LG Optimus F6. And let's power on my phone. And the first thing you guys want to do is go to your settings. This is my own custom uh, launcher, so it looks like this. Don't worry, your F6 doesn't look like this. This is, this is just me. You go to your settings. You go to your uh, security. And where is it? Where you see unknown sources, you type in yes. And it's always going to say this, but of course, you're not downloading viruses or, you know, fucking uh, apps for, I don't know, just stuff that you don't trust. You click OK. You go to your browser. Type in Lightflow Pro. Lightflow APK. Uh, pro right there so that's what you're going to search for light flow apk pro you scroll down to the one that says light flow led notifications by paid app free block spot should be the second website if you, if you type it in correctly <clears throat> it's going to look like this and this is what the app looks like let me show you guys my uh drawer looks like that light flow all right we'll go back to the browser you scroll down to where it says download here use your metro web and it should be downloading oh no excuse me you have to go down here where it says no preview available but then you just press download again your metro web And sometimes you have to press it multiple times. When I first did it, it worked on the first time. But as you guys can see, it's having trouble. But it does work. I don't know why it's not trying now. Let's try the Chrome. <laughs> yeah, and it says this type of file can harm your device. It says that about all non uh, Google Play downloads. You know, it tells you the same thing about music or, you know, apps that you uh, download online. Of course, it's going to always say that. But once you download it, as you can, guys can saw, I had to use the Chrome browser just to download it. You uh, open it. Uh, oh, by the way, my custom browser has this fast launch uh, setting where you can just you know automatically have those apps on your notification. It's nice. If you guys want to know more about this launcher, let me know in the comments. If not, I'm going to go ahead and continue with the tutorial. And of course, it's going to say your package installer. Uh, yes. And install. Installing. done now you just go to your well not the browser the uh your app drawer your life flow app the first thing you guys want to do is go to your settings enable light flow right there and with all this um this is just if your some devices are require root but this, the F6 does not require root, so you don't have to worry about rooting your phone or anything. LED brightness. I wouldn't mess with any of this, okay? All this is just say, all you have to do is enable light flow, and that's it. You get out of there. Then now, you go to your notifications. For example, um... For your blue, uh, let's say for your, um, these are all the settings, I mean, excuse me, the things that have uh, constant uh, lights, notifications, you guys can set. For example, for no signal, I'm going to try no signal, enable notification, okay? You guys always have to, it's always going to look like this. When you first get it, 
and you want to put it like let's say for text messages but for example i'm gonna show you the no signal if i can find it all right or no signal you have to always press uh enable notification uh uh then you swipe to the right like this enable light you have to turn it on and then you have to switch your color and of course you can just uh, choose the color you always want for that specific notification so this is the no signal notification so when i have no signal at all let's say it's on airplane mode i'm gonna put sky blue so now i'm gonna go ahead and put my phone on airplane mode and now sky blue there you go now my f6 is a led is a light blue sky blue and i'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate again now i'm gonna try a uh, normal blue now it should change to a darker blue there you go now that's a darker blue as you guys can see now let's try uh indigo liliac magenta magenta is like a pink what the hell the could have sworn it was a blue but whatever now when you have no service it's gonna glow supposedly a pink there you go pink magenta equals it's not so much of a hot pink it's much more of a salmon pink dark pink i don't know i'm not an artist but yeah you guys can tell that's for and this is the one that you have for my kick just plain white it looks nice i like the white one the best there you go now you got your own custom led notifications for your f6 and of course i'm gonna switch it back to sky blue that's the one i originally had for my uh no service oh of course you can you can also customize your own color like that but of course, it's not going to be that barely. It's going to be as close as possible as the uh, the F6 supports. But of course, you know, it's nice to try with. Whoa, custom colors like a dark purple. So now let's see what it looks like. Oh, it actually did change to my own specific. Yeah, it's not, now it's more of a, a light, very, very light violet. It looks dark on the phone, but it's actually pretty light. It's like if you just shade a piece of paper lightly with purple. It's real nice. Let's try this, this sky blue. All right, new color. Now, my new notification light will be. And there you go. Look at that. Customize your own colors. Real nice. I think I'll set it back to sky blue like I normally had it. So now. Yeah, on the camera, it looks the same, but I promise you, it looks very different in person. And that's how you customize your own LED sounds. I, I wouldn't put sounds. I mean, it's not really uh, enable or disable vibration notifications. That's if you want it to vibrate every time it has it, it lights up. But I wouldn't put that. It's just it's going to waste your battery more. And now you can control your uh, LED flash rate, how fast it blinks, your light duration. So let's say once I put my my phone on airplane mode and I have no service, it's going to start the LED. But after 10 minutes, it's going to stop to save battery. So let's say uh, um, I put it do not automatically switch off. So as long as I have um, no phone uh, service or Wi-Fi or anything at all, it's going to continuously glow blue nonstop. But of course, you can stop it after a certain time limit if you think you can notice. Uh, let's say me it takes me no more than five minutes for me to notice my uh, that my phone is blinking so because it's always on me so yeah that's the way you uh, set it to last as long as you want and back button LED it's uh now you can have just a solid you guys can see but of course it overrides the um the setting for the how fast it's going so it's gonna stop and then go and then stop and go so i wouldn't do it so i'll just leave it off and that's all you really have to do with it it's just enable notification then you go back and that was just for my no signal let's say for your uh sms your voicemail you get a youtube uh update you can set it to glow purple uh for your mix uh your text messages you can make it light up green of course you have to enable the light like oh excuse me you have to enable the light course then you switch enable light again and then you choose your own notification color so i have turquoise for my uh, text messages 
And for my low battery, I have, I have purple. Of course, you gotta enable it. Enable again. And, uh, oh, indigo, excuse me. So when my phone starts glowing indigo, the LED notification, the home button starts glowing purple, it means I have low battery. So this is how you guys do it. And of course, for your own specific people like this, of course you can, um, every time you select the context, that contact is going to glow a uh, specific color when you receive anything from them. Call, text message, whatever. See, you can add. You can add their each email, whatever. It's whatever you, Whenever you get a Gmail from that specific person, it's going to glow that specific color. You can, of course, edit it as well. You guys can see. But i just rather have it a single color for everybody so I can know what it is, a text or an email or whatever. And, of course, you can uh, sort alphabetically, you know. Use them, uh, use them by the most used. And of course, you can add. These are all your supported. But once you go back, you go to your uh, settings, and you have to go down and if I can find it. Oh, you also have um camera flash LED so you can control it when the screen is off basically lets you you know your flash uh, light up too but I don't really see the point of it since uh, you know your phone already has its own LED the home button it just looks nicer than a plain flash I mean you know but yeah this is basically how you uh, install the app the pro light flow again the, the, that's the app you need and just follow the steps I did in the video and you can customize your own notifications to your own specific preferred LED color for your home bun. Like I said, for my kick I have a uh, white, for my text messages I have uh, light green, low battery I have purple, missed calls I have red. So every time you see a your home bun lighting up a, a specific color that you set it to, you're going to know what your notification is. And that's basically it guys. Thank you guys for watching. I hope it's useful. If you guys have got any more questions, please comment below. Hope this was uh, easy to do. And I try to be specific and as step by step as possible so you guys can see how to uh, edit your own LED. And yes, this is my F6. Some people might be like, oh, it's only on F3. But no, this is my F6. I have not tried this app at the F3, but it should be able to work because the, they're, they're about the same build number. Like I said, just go to the go to online and download this app and follow the rules or the steps. See, like right now I have no service, but of course it's glowing blue. So when I turn my airplane mode off, it stops because I already have service again. But of course, if somebody messages me or kicks me or whatever, uh, it's going to start lighting up again to let me know I have that notification. Okay, that's how you do it. Thanks for watching. Now I got to go back and watch Mexico play the world cup I'm playing right now they're playing at the moment so i'm in here doing this <laughs> but yeah thank you guys for watching and peace